So this is the American Tactical M1911 Military Edition, 45 ACP. And I've, the instructions that come with this gun are not very clear. It's black and white, first off, so you can't really get a good look at what you're supposed to do. So I figured I would make a disassembly and reassembly video of it. I've seen a few online, but the way they're doing it seems to be a little more difficult than how I figured out how to do it. So I figured I would share my knowledge with you guys. So the first thing you want to do, take out the clip, make sure there's nothing in there, chamber's clear. Put the safety on, cock back the hammer, put the safety on, and then there's this button right here. You need to push it in and turn this bushing to the right. And once you do this, it'll release the spring, so be very careful because it could come flying out. Okay, so the next thing you need to do is you need to line this up right here, the slide lock in that little circular notch there, and that allows you to push this pin out, which lets you take the slide lock out. And then you can take that out. Remove the spring, and I like to leave the spring guide in. I find it's easier to reassemble it that way. And then to take the barrel out, push that forward. Or first, you gotta take this bushing out and to do that you gotta turn it all the way to the right and then it should come out okay now you can remove the barrel and that's the disassembly there's about eight different pieces including the guide pin for the spring now I'll show you the easiest way, in my opinion, to reassemble it. So basically, put the barrel back in. And then you want to put this notch up, because that's what locks the slide pin into place, this notch right here. And you got to try to keep it up, but if it falls down, you can kind of wobble it into place to get the pin back inside. So then I put the spring in just like, just like that. that back up slide that into place and then you're gonna want to lock the safety to keep it from moving okay safety's in and now you got to get that guide pin lined up so Actually, safety was supposed to be off. So, get it back into the same position where you took it out. Kind of wiggle that notch into place to where you can get the pin in. And there, I just got it. So, now slide this back to the circle part. It's right about there. And then that'll just snap right back into place. And then now you put the safety on to lock that in place. 
And then you're going to put this bushing back into place. And turn it to the right to get it in place. And then to put the locking pin back in, you need to turn it back to the left. So what I do is I just find a gap in the spring and turn it to the left. And then that allows you to put this back in place. Push that bushing down, put that button down, turn the bushing back to how it originally was. Get my glove out of there. And then there you go. Disassembled and reassembled. Now let's check it for, make sure it works. Put a clip in, see if we get good bullet ejection. And there you go. It's as simple as that. Please like and subscribe. Thank you.